We'll ask you about the donuts first. What do you think of them, and who do you reckon would love to hold into the most from the team? Oh, I reckon Josh Green. Yeah. But he's actually been quite good of late. He's lost a lot of skin folds, so um, he's in actually really good nick, but I think earlier on he would have liked to bunch into a couple. Yeah. How do you feel coming up against the uh, the old team pretty much straight away? Yeah, I'm excited about it. Yeah, it's going to be a, a good test for for us again. Um, you know, coming up coming up against West Coast on the weekend, and that was a good challenge. But um, you know, it doesn't get any easier playing North. Um, personally, I'm really excited for it. It's going to be a, a good day. Um, a lot of me uh, mates play there, so um, it's going to be good coming up against them. What was that? Sorry. I haven't, nah. So I'm sure I'll get a few few text messages during the week about it, and um, yeah, I look forward to it. Yeah, yeah, it was difficult, but um, you know, personally, I just, as I've said, I needed a fresh start. Um, things weren't just going the way. I would have liked and you know I got pushed out a fair bit and away from the role I I'm, I suppose I'm good at um, so the opportunity to come up here and um, be part of a young group and help some younger guys out and be a part of a, a pretty good midfield was um, something I couldn't go past and yeah just a fresh start was what I was after and you know, I'm loving every minute of it so far. I know what yeah, oh, I don't know. It's, it's another game, but you know, it's going to be a lot of fun. I think getting out there and playing against them. I've trained with them and you know played with them for for six years, so playing against them is going to be a bit different. But you know, I'm just excited. It's going to be a lot of fun to to be out there and you know give each other a bit of stick as well. So that'll no, be it'll be good fun. You sort of said you got sort of pushed out of the role that, you, that you're good at. Is it a chance to show them, you know, what they're missing out on? And, and oh, I don't know. Play that role I don't know. They've role. they've got a lot of quality midfielders in their team, so um, I'm sure they're pretty happy with what, what they've got. So um, no, nah, I don't know. I'll, I'll be just doing everything to um, play the best for the Brisbane Lions and um, help the team get the four points because that's what we're we're after. Um, not after about nothing to do with me playing against my old team. It's just all about us and getting the four points because that's what we're here for. What was the assessment of the weekend's performance? Yeah, it's hard because you, you lose by 64 points and it's a pretty disappointing day. But there were a lot of positives to come out of it. Um, you know, we hit 100 points over there, which is pretty hard to do. I think they only Brisbane done that four times last year so it's definitely a positive um, there's f a few touch-ups that we need to fix on and you know we'll work on that thro throughout the week and um, yeah just try and get better it's, it's going to happen with a young team we're going to be a bit inconsistent every now and then but it's just about fixing it as soon as possible oh it doesn't get any easier with Drew Petrie and, and Jared Wade and players like that so um, yeah our defenders Took a big learning curve out of, out of that game, and they'll be looking uh, forward to making amends this week. Left. Oh, absolutely! I think the big biggest thing that we took out of it, like we never gave up. Like, and that's that's such a good thing. Um, I've been part of you know North Melbourne. We've had some bigger losses over there in the past by bigger margins. So, um, and they were, we were a more experienced side, I guess. So. So for a younger group to go over there and um, play the way we did and not give up, play four quarters and just the effort was there the whole game was really pleasing and you know you see guys like Josh Shackey, see what he can do, um, it's just going to be great to be part of that and um, see him improve each week as well. You touched on the defenders there, um, not being easier for them, but Lepper sort of touched on post-match the sort of turnovers and that sort yeah. of stuff that killed, is that yeah. what you got out of your system? Yeah, definitely, but you know, we can't um, go away from taking risks and playing that attacking attacking style, um, that's what's going to win us games and that's what got us you know, scoring so much, so uh, we can't take that away. There's going to be mistakes, but yeah, as I said, it's just about fixing them as soon as possible and um, yeah, moving forward, but um, yeah, that was a big big area that we need to work on, that's for sure. And what about the Gabba? Is your home ground now? Have you enjoyed playing on it in the past? Do you have fond memories on this ground? Yeah, oh, not really actually. We, Brisbane have touched us up, touched North up a few times when I was on the um, other end. So um, it's a great ground. It's a big deck. Um, 
I love it, personally love playing here. Um, actually, first one of the first times I've been on it as a Brisbane Lions player um, today, so it's going to be good out, uh, good running out there on the weekend um, against my old side. How do you think uh, North assess Brisbane? I mean, you would have prepared to play Brisbane quite a few years. How do you think they assess Brisbane as a club and as a list at the moment? It's hard to say because, you know, um, there's been a few ins and outs at Brisbane, but in the past, you know, really exciting. Like when, when Brisbane get their um, game going, really exciting and attacking. So um, if we can get that going, we're, we're a hard team to stop. So. Um, as I said, just those turnovers, if we can touch up on a few of those things, um, we'll go a long way, yeah. You talked about your game and what you do best. I guess, can you tell us what role the results are using? Yeah, just getting back to when I was playing my best footy um, about three years ago as a probably more inside, inside midfielder um, who can go forward and kick a few goals as well. So. Um, yeah, just being that one of those inside um, ball winners and um, just getting the team going, I guess, yeah. You mentioned uh, breaking 100 points, obviously that's fairly significant because was an issue with the team on the field. Yeah, definitely, and that, that just comes with how um, we've trained over the summer, um, just with ball movement and, and, and stuff like that. So, um, yeah, we're trying to be as attacking as possible, but you need to try and strike a balance as well with defence. So, uh, we're just continually working on that.